Wow! <laughs> Yo, what's Gucci, my dudes and my dudettes? Everyone's included here. I know it's been a minute and I apologize for that. I plan to be uploading pretty frequently in the near future, so stay tuned for that. I just got an email and I have a package for me waiting downstairs. I have no idea what it is. It's been a minute since I got a package, so I'm really excited to see just what we got. I hope it's something cool. I hope it's something exciting. Either way, I'm gonna show you guys. So let's go get it. <laughs> a lot of packages on this channel but every time I get one I still feel that same happy joyous childlike so excited I feel like a kid on Christmas morning this is awesome all right so this package is from Swagtron it's their brand new Swag Cycle Pro which is a mini electric bike I think it's foldable I really should have done my research on this before opening it up but hey I like to experience things the way it is so let's just go ahead and crack it open and see what we got. Ah, my favorite thing ever. Oh. Gotta love boxes within boxes. Luckily, I don't need to do my research. All the important info is right here on the box itself. So the Swagtron Swag Cycle Pro folding electric scooter. Riding speeds up to 18 miles per hour. All electric, which is eco-friendly because we gotta save the environment. USB charging has a headlight and it's app ready, which is super sick. Let's do it to it. <laughs> Let's take a look at this small box because I don't feel like dealing with this at the moment. I imagine this small box is all the accessories, tools, and a seat. I think some assembly is required here. Luckily, with the magic of video editing, I can put this together in three, two, one. 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 Boom! Easy peasy. Got this thing all assembled together, and I only had to read the instructions twice. Got this beautiful thing all together. Now let's go ahead and charge her up. Put some air in those tires. And take her out for a test ride. My prediction is, I think it's gonna be awesome. All right, so when I got the bike, I texted Nikki a picture of it. And she said, ooh, I could do that. And look at her. She's on the bike before me, <laughs> falling before me. So I guess you're gonna test it out first. So what'd you think of it? What'd you think of the Swag Cycle Pro? You were the first person to ride it and it looked like you were having a blast. It was really easy. Uh, all you have to do is get on and go. It didn't take um, a really big learning curve. You just hop on and, and zoom past. Speaking of zooming, you can go really, really fast, really quickly. Um, I went so fast that Ronnie got mad because he couldn't keep up with me. And then thirdly, I really like it because it's super cute. All right, so yesterday I wasn't able to really ride this because it got too dark after Nikki wrote it, so today we're really testing it out. Time 
time it is. It's time for the burnout test. You know that little part inside of you that really wants a motorcycle because it's like really cool? I kind of feel like that itch is being scratched while riding this thing. It's just so much fun to ride. Check out this burnout though. <laughs> uh, I, I can make it burn out. Okay, go. Do it. How do I... Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> Maybe if you put it on dirt, it'll be cooler. All right, burnout take. Got him. So we just found this little off-road path over there. Could never really do it on a skateboard because I didn't have off-road wheels. But on this thing, I feel like I can go anywhere. I'm gonna go try that path out. So there's this crazy, big, gnarly dead man's hill. I have no idea. Ah, I think I have to ride down it. I really don't want to, but uh, I think I'm gonna do it. Andy, do you think I can survive going down that hill? First of all, look at it. Uh, There's no clear path. Where uh, are you gonna ride down? You're not gonna ride down those those routes. I have faith in you. You have faith in me? Yeah, dude. Thanks, man. Because I'm doing this, you guys gotta give this video a thumbs up right now, please. please. Can I have this bike if you die? Yeah, if I die, you can have this bike. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna make my way up. It's hard, I don't know if it, like, you can see it on camera. This is a steep hill. You gotta ride down. Dude, there's so many like tree roots. Dude, this is so gnarly. <laughs> it's so much scarier from up here. <laughs> my back wheel is up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> There he goes. I don't know where he went. Oh wait, here he is, he's coming. I'm using my yappa dappa doofy. Dude, that was insane. That was so gnarly. Like, the whole way down, I was literally like this. I felt like I was gonna go over the handlebars the whole time. I don't know if you could tell, I was squeezing the brakes the whole way down and that didn't stop me. <laughs> the hill is just too steep and it was all rocky and gravelly and leafy and uh, it was fun. <laughs> all right guys, so let's get into my thoughts on the Swag Cycle Pro. And honestly, I only have good things to say about it. Mostly. Let's start off with everything I love about it. First off, the form factor is awesome. It's super portable and can be stored anywhere in a home, an apartment. You can easily fold it up and just shove it in your car. It's very compact and I like that. The disc brakes work well, it's zippy, and with the way they designed the frame, it has you sitting in a very comfortable riding position. With a top speed of 18 miles per hour and a max range of 15 miles, this is definitely something you gotta consider if you're looking for an alternate means of transportation. I think it's perfect for college campuses or commuting around a city, as long as it's a relatively flat city, cause this thing can only go up hills rated at 12 degrees. I've unboxed a bunch of different toys on this channel and honestly, I think this is one of my favorite things to ride right now. Once you get past the idea that you may vaguely resemble this guy, it's a lot of fun. It's super easy to use, and it just brings back a lot of memories from when I was a kid, riding my bike around the neighborhood, just exploring, adventuring. This thing's awesome. And I don't think you have to be a kid to enjoy this. I think most people would be able to easily hop on this thing and just go for a ride, as long as you know how to ride a bike. Young kids, teens, adults, older adults, really old adults can all have fun on this bike. I would never let my mom ride one of my electric skateboards, but I would definitely let her ride this and I would not be afraid that she would fall, break her back, and not too dark. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> the only negative thing I can think about the Swag Cycle Pro is where you put your feet on the pegs on the front wheel. It sort of interferes a little bit with how you steer the bike, but you get used to it in about a minute or so, and after that, you're just cruising. Honestly, this thing is so much fun. If you guys get one, all you're gonna wanna do is ride it. You're gonna wanna find any excuse to go out and just ride this thing. Oh, we're out of milk? I'll get some. Couple of sketchy dudes fighting down the street? I'll check it out. Uncle Danny wants to meet up in California? I'll be there in a sec. This thing is awesome, and all in all, I give the Swagtron Swag Cycle Pro two humongous thumbs up. Highly recommend it to anyone. And at $4.99 right now, 
definitely worth it. Huge shout out to Swagtron for hooking me up with this bike to review. Be sure to check them out, link down below for some more information. They got a lot of sweet products down there. Anyways guys, that's gonna be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up because every like helps to grow this channel. Let me know what your thoughts are on the Swag Cycle Pro. Leave them down in the comment section down below. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell to be a part of the Stoke Squad. And until next time guys, stay stoked and out. It doesn't quite work well in sand. But then again, who bikes on sand? <laughs>